Libra, hi, it's Lisa here from What's a Name Tarot. I'm here to do your weekly reading for the week of Monday the 18th to the 24th of April 2022. These are general readings only, so just take with you what resonates. Check your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, any number synchronicities that may occur, and cross watches are welcome. The Fool is the one that just leapt out there. A leap of faith. Overall, Seven of Swords. Some sort of deceptive energy that you are ready to actually walk away from here. Picking up what serves you and moving on forward. And um, might be some gossip, some backstabbing. You're not wanting a bar of it past energies you had the full the star ace of pentacles feel you saw it like you took your um you know it was a leap of faith that you took in the past towards a new beginning um towards your goals and your dreams it may have actually worked out for you given the rest of the reading and um it all started with taking that chance that first step and going for it present energies four of wands ten of pentacles the empress very aware that your dreams have come through here. There's stability, there's commitment, there's success. In the core of your reading, Ten of Pentacles. Love that. Very intuitive energy, very aware of how you feel, of how someone else feels, what's going on around you, but also very aware of the success, the stability that you have out of taking that first step, that leap of faith back there. Future energies, you have the Ace of Wands, Six of Swords, the Magus. I feel this deceptive energy has snuck in here somewhere along the line. Um, and you may be waiting for an apology. You may be waiting a very long time. And it's just talking about being able to move forward, even if it's done in secret, under cover of darkness, and start this whole new journey. Um, manifesting where you are heading towards. Creating the magic, putting the plans into place getting everything to work how you're wanting it to work um, but keeping it real at the same time so libra love all that let us see i do clarify everything see what's going on Overall, Seven of Swords. Let's see what's happened here. I'm able to release all that. You have the Magician, King of Swords, Knight of Cups. Wow, could have been some deceptive energy around love here. Um, but able to now think with your head over your heart, think things through clearly and logically, and take action to walk away from that energy. Uh, manifestation it may also be you're manifesting someone here using your head over your heart keeping that manifestation real and manifesting this love because you've walked away from this deceptive energy which possibly happened even further back here and able to focus on this um, this offer of love that is here so past energies Possibly this leap of faith is around this love. We do have the fall with the moon, three of swords, five of wands. Yeah, could be dealing with the Pisces, hidden fears, but somebody has broken your heart, possibly due to a third party situation. It could have been around love. It may have been around home or around work. A lot of conflict, a lot of disagreements, a lot of drama. Um, but I feel like you have actually taken this leap of faith to release that energy and to focus on something that you're wanting and that moon is giving you that clarity to still see clearly before taking that leap of faith there. Something's happened even further back I feel and that's the deceptive energy you've actually been walking away from here. Because here the star you have Seven of Swords again, Temperance, Princess of Pentacles. And again, walking away from that deceptive energy and not looking back. 
you've got your wishes you've got your goals and your dreams here you're not looking back you're moving forward and you're moving forward freely and steadily going with the flow could be dealing with the Sagittarius there's an offer here to work with you teamwork collaboration um, it may be that it brings your dreams to life a lot more quicker than what you initially thought it may be this offer from this knight of cups clarifying overall for the week um, but it may be what you're wanting or who you're wanting as you come to this ace of pentacles look at this the emperor the world seven of pentacles a lot of hard work to get things off the ground for this new beginning but divine timing you're in control of the situation could be dealing with an Aries or Sagittarius but you do have this level-headedness logicality confidence divine masculine energy has your back along with this hard work to get this new journey off the ground and um, right now it's meant to be with that universe there having your back Present energies, Four of Wands, Libra. You have the Two of Swords, Five of Cups, the Tower. Yeah, a decision needed to be made to walk away from this deceptive energy as we were mentioning before, releasing that out into the universe to focus on building something solid from the ground up. You are clarifying Four of Wands, stability, solid foundation right there. There's sadness that comes with leaving this deceptive energy behind. You can't just switch things off just like that. But um, I always say, don't let others tell you to hurry up and move on or get over it. It's always done in your own time, in your own way. But there's loving energy around you. There is the stability here. And a decision um, is being made to release what's been holding you back. In the core of your reading, you've got it. Ten of Pentacles. Success. Knight of Swords, King of Wands, Judgment. The success may have come quite quickly. And it is also saying just slow down now. Keep an open mind towards where you're heading. You do have control over your dreams and your goals and what you want. And um, keep an open mind. Don't judge others. I say don't let others judge you. But slow things down. Keep an open mind and shift that goalpost from the success that you obviously already have here to where um, to another level again to go after that and you've got the empress love that three of pentacles the star the hanged man could be dealing with an aquarius but very aware that you need that it may be you that needs to make a decision here you're waiting for someone else to make their mind up and you may be waiting a long time you're hanging around in limbo sitting on the fence waiting for that decision to be made but um, if you make that decision yourself cutting yourself free from that hanged man energy and aware that that you're able to make that decision yourself there teamwork collaboration partnership maybe this kind of partnership with this prince of cups here but um, putting the plans into place together and building something solid love that libra so future energies ace of wands these flew out you have the two of wands queen of pentacles six of pentacles love that from that ace of wands to the two of wands very focused on where you want to be heading towards and knowing that it won't just land in front of you or land in your lap that you do have to keep balanced and you have to keep balanced in order to keep moving forward freely towards your goals and your dreams proud of your achievements proud of how far you've come and um and again still balanced enough now to focus on even getting further success shifting that goalpost as we mentioned earlier equal give and take if you do all the giving someone else does all the taking and that movement towards your goals may become a bit zigzagged or staggered um, there so making sure that things remain balanced six of swords libra you have the lovers ace of swords the devil could be dealing with gemini or capricorn here but cutting the crap out from the past Cutting yourself free from this devil energy, 
there with this ace of swords setting yourself free from this negative toxic energy something or someone that is preventing you from moving forward which is why you're needing to step out in secret under cover of darkness not letting everybody know what's going on significant other soulmate twin flame on this journey with you whether in, whether it's an existing relationship whether it's somebody extremely brand new could be this offer overall or that clarification there but um, problem shared problem halved kicking that devil in the butt and focusing on moving forward um, with that six of swords that we're clarifying and you finish with the magis as i said maybe who you want here you have the fool which you had right back there to start when that flew out eight of wands and the high priestess yeah, you still got your guard up a bit, but the communication lines need to remain open. Everyone on the same page, getting the full story. Manifestation, manifesting somebody possibly to come in here and to help you with kicking this energy out into the universe where it belongs and taking that leap of faith. It may be taking a leap of faith to bring someone into the situation right here, but to balance things out, we have that six of pentacles right there, to balance things out, um, it may be taking that balanced energy to release that negative energy there. But it needs this guard to be let down ever so slightly and everyone on the same page and that manifestation to remain um, in a balanced way achievable so love that libra let's see what the universe has to say you have the eight of pentacles the universe says the universe and the emperor well you've got nothing to worry about here love that okay so you have got could be dealing with an aries but very focused, very dedicated. Still be aware of what else is happening around you. But divine timing, the universe has your back and you're in control of the situation. Divine masculine energy, very brave, very confident, very level-headed here. That emperor has your back. That universe has your back. But it's about shifting that focus around while you are very hard working in order to see that... Um, what is out there or who is out there that does have your back possibly that gemini boom so that's what i have libra do hope it helped thanks for watching and i'll see you all next time see ya bye